Okay. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Okay. Okay. So Shahad, we were told to pick a student for student appreciation. And I chose you for student appreciation. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> because you represent so many students in a positive way. And I chose you because you make me laugh every single day, but also because I've seen tremendous growth in you from ninth grade until now. Yeah. You bring a maturity and enlightenment to your writing and our class discussions that makes me very proud. Oh, thanks, Sly. So thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Mediums and techniques is awesome, and you have become a true leader in the art department. You rock. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever Sly. you're ready. <laughs> Hi! Hi! Yeah, you know I don't do mornings. So I, I don't know, surprise. this is really weird. <laughs> but I was asked about a student who inspires me to come to work every day. And right away, your name came to mind because you inspire me to be here every day and do the best that I can do every day. Because I know that you have goals set for yourself and that you work hard every day to try and achieve those goals. So I just wanted to let you know that you inspire me to do the best. Thank you. You're good, but let's just, I want to see your face because she has something really I want to nice tell you to say. Something really cool. Okay. okay. Can you can you do can we do this? Yes. Can you do it with me? Yes. Okay. Hi to me every time you see me and you care a lot about the school and you like to tell me when things are wrong, like when the sprinklers are broken so that I can fix them. Okay. Um I think you're just a great person and I think Esperanza is really lucky to have you. And so you make me happy to come to work as the principal every single day. And that's why you're in my office, so I can tell you that. Okay. Okay, can I get a fist yes. bump? All right. Was that so bad? No. Okay. One student who impacted my life in a positive way. And I would like to tell you that every time I see you, whether it's way across campus, you always yell hi to me. And that really makes my day. So I wanted to say thank you, Maddie Klein, okay, for making my day. <laughs> that actually made my day. Thank you. He is an example of my fifth grade that comes in and is always ready to learn and makes teaching fun. School every day to work. And I decided that that, that student would be you. Um, and the reason I picked you is because I think you're totally amazing. Um, I love everything about you. You're such a motivated student. You love French, and I love French, obviously, so that makes, uh, makes it a work for me. And you're also very hardworking, um, on, on top of the fact that you're compassionate, you're respectful, you're sweet. You're just one of those, you know, lovely, lovely children that teachers love to teach. And I'm so happy to have you in my class. So now I'll say the last thing in French here. Tu es super, Elisabeth. <laughs> Merci beaucoup. <laughs> I wanted to tell you that students like you help keep me motivated to do my best as a teacher. You give me hope that our society is in good hands moving forward. And even if I don't say it much, I really appreciate hardworking, intelligent, enlightened students like you. <laughs> I think it's best said in a poem. Sometimes I get tired and I need motivation to be inspired. I have to tell myself, don't disparage. Next period, you'll see Marissa Barrage. Stop! <laughs> that was so Thank sweet. you. Thank you. you such a good kid. Oh my gosh, stop. You may definitely make my fifth period better every single day, but um, you make coming to school something I like to do. And um, I like how you're happy and you're kind and thoughtful and just incredibly hardworking. So I just wanted to say thank you for making my days so much better and me becoming a teacher a reason why I did. So thank you. So uh, I selected you because you're an exemplary student, you have a positive attitude, uh, you've found a way to overcome, to persevere uh, things that you faced and it's inspiring to me and I know other students, so I just want to say thank you. Thank you, Mr. Ritz. Yeah, you're welcome. High school career. To see you now, to where you are, academically, socially, um, is quite an achievement from, I think, where you started in your freshman year. Had a couple little giddy-ups, is that correct? Yes. In the freshman year, but uh, we've corrected those and I'd like to see you continue on the same path that you're working on and I'm thankful that you turned things
things around and are having a good experience here in high school and uh, in life in general. Congratulations. I think, I think you're amazing. You have such a great attitude about yourself and you bring such a warmth to our department. Um, and I just, uh, I think you're a very awesome student. Thank so, you. You were my chosen student. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I love it every day when you walk in and you say hello. Uh, you're always saying goodbye. How was your weekend? I'm going to come back on Monday. You don't have a good weekend on Friday. So I chose you as a student to honor. Thank you, Mr. Cantor. He, he loves French. He always gives his best and he's he's been giving us some proverbs in French throughout and he's <laughs> been a great part of our class. Nice. Fantastic. There you go. Hi Katie. Hi. I wanted to thank you and let you know how you inspired me to be a more appreciative person. I can't think of one time on campus when I've seen you when you ha when there hasn't been a smile on your face. You radiate energy and your positivity is contagious. You are every teacher and every coach's dream, and I'm confident others feel the same way I do. Um, you're the epitome of Aztec pride. Thanks. Oh, really? <laughs> really? That's cool. <laughs> Ian Holloway is the reason that I love coming to Esperanza High School every day because he's the first person to welcome me here, and whenever I see his smiling face on campus, it's a reminder of why this is a great place to be and why I love working with kids. You're the greatest. Positive you are every single day. I don't even know if you realize you do this, I but don't. every time I pass something out, and horrible things, like more romantic poems, you always look me in the eye and say thank you. And it means so much to me because it makes me feel like you genuinely want to be here, and it's just such a pleasure having you in class. Thank and you, you stand out to me. You really do. Thank You're you. a wonderful, wonderful young woman. That's so nice. Thank you. And I hope you know that. I thank hope I'm not the only person who says that. Because you are that person. Oh, really? So I just want to thank you so much for always um, being curious and wanting to learn and asking great questions. And um, you inspire me to want to do better at my job. So yeah, of thank course. you. Of course. Thank you. And I'm proud of you. So okay. Mia, like I have a choice of what I do in life. Gosh darn it, I'm going to cry. God dang it. <laughs> but kids like you are why I come to school every day. Kids like you that show change and, and prospect and see the big picture and don't just get stuff done. I love coming to school every day. God, I can't do that, you can't. But it's kids like you that make me want to come every day even when it gets hard and I appreciate it. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Ah, I love that even better. Okay. I've been Lizzie for four years Aww. as a dancer. She is absolutely wonderful. This year she comes in before school almost every day and says hello and you know wants to use my refrigerator. <laughs> and I have her for a TA third. She's on company and is one of the officers there. She is always asking what she can do to make life easier. She's always checking up on me to make sure that I stay organized and she really loves dance. So it's just a joy to have her all the time. And it always is fun to see her at school. Good. Because you're always on time, you're always prepared, you always got great things to contribute to the class, and I really appreciate every every time you come to class, that great enthusiasm that you have, and um, I hope you know I, I get to see you throughout your you know your years here at high school, and I again I appreciate everything that you do as a student. I think this is my best. This is my best class actually. It's really nice, you know. I do kind of watch news, you know, you're the one who actually motivated me, you know, watch the news and everything, to, you know, catch up on stuff and everything. It's, it's been really nice actually to know what's going on now. I appreciate it. You're very positive all the time, and sometimes I need that. And then I would say that you challenge yourself to be a better person, a better student, a better daughter, a better friend, and you make the tough decisions. And that's really admirable in somebody that's your age. The maturity you show is, is pretty awesome. So. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Uh, you got a positive attitude and you always joke around. Even though I give you a hard time about it, I appreciate it and you always, uh, you always bring me a smile. So I really appreciate you. Oh, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Appreciate it. No problem. Um, I chose you. Um, you're just a light on this campus. You always say hi to me. You, you're just a bright and shiny, friendly face. And I'm so thankful that you're here. And 
that I get to see you every day. So I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you for being here and thank you for being the kid that you are. You're both good. So, um, you're one of us and we love having you. My staff and I always look forward to hearing about your day. Uh, last year we had you during sixth period so we would hear about your, you know, your whole school day. Now we have you during first. So um, we think you're a great kid and um, we want you to keep, keep being you. Thank so you thanks much. for all you do. That's Catherine. Okay. <laughs> and you, for me, are that person. Aww. Because you always have a positive attitude. Even when things are not going your way, you're always smiling. Every time you come and see me to ask a question or you know, ask about something, you have a smile on your face and that in turn makes me have a good day no matter what, how my day started out. So you are one of the reasons why I come to school every day. Thank you. You're welcome. Ever you are ready. Michael, you completely inspire me to be a better teacher, to show up to work every day, which I've not missed a single day. I don't want to miss the class that you're in. And all of this comes because you know how to approach this, the discipline that we're engaged within. You think about what it means and how it is to be used you know how to look at the textbook. You know how to break it down, figure out what are they trying to say. Then you come to class and you ask good questions. They're well phrased. You do your best to keep your emotions detached from your academic learning. And all of that makes me, just me the individual teacher, want to do better and try to inspire others to be more like you. Um, I feel totally privileged, without a doubt, to have you in my class, and you will be entirely unforgettable as I continue through my career as a teacher. Wow. So I wanted to say thank you for being one of my <gasps> students. I'm getting all teary-eyed. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I mean so much, you have no idea. <laughs>